morning, I'm Earl. I'm Josh. And I'm Irma. And today is a red day on Monday, October 8th. It's now time for your morning announcements. This is what's going on around Albemarle. The AHS forensics team will be having a meeting today from 5 to 6 in the drama room, drama room after school. Hope to see you there. Ally Week is quickly approaching, beginning October 15th and ending October 19th. Show your support for the lesbian, gay, bisexual, and transgender community by wearing red and orange on Monday, October 15th, yellow on Tuesday, green on Wednesday, purple and blue on Thursday, and black on Friday. There will be an indoor track interest meeting on Wednesday at the beginning of chat in the small gym. If you cannot make the meeting, see Coach Nagel in room 209. There will be a wrestling informational meeting in room 238, first half of lunch during chat on Wednesday. Conditioning begins October 16th. Meet in the weight room near the small gym at 4 p.m. If you must have, you must have a physical on file with the athletic office to participate. This Saturday, the AHS cheerleaders came in second place at their competition at Monticello High School. Congratulations, girls. Madison House tutors will not be here today, October 8th, or Tuesday, October 9th, due to their fall break. Sessions will resume on Wednesday, October 10th. Students, remember, if you plan on bringing a date who does not attend AHS, you must have a guest form signed by an administrator before you can buy a homecoming ticket for him or her. They may be picked up in SCA during all four lunches on red days in the cafeteria. The National Honor Society is sponsoring a blood drive on Tuesday, October 16th. It will be in the small gym. Please sign up to give, and the sign-up will be in the cafeteria during lunch this week and next. Starting today through the end of the month, third period red day classes will be going to a computer lab to complete a peer support survey. To help understand the different types of bullying, the Safe Schools Healthy Students Outmar Sarge for Project created this video to help us out. You've heard a lot about bullying. But here's what you need to know. Bullying is a real problem. Even if you're not involved, you know someone who is. And the fact is, the effects of bullying can last a lifetime. Bullying takes on different forms. And you're going to need to know how to identify them. Give me the ball, it's my turn now. Hey, I was here first. Hey, I need my ball back. So, what are you gonna do about it? Guys, come here. You have to look at this picture of Mary. <laughs> what is she thinking? That's so ugly. You've got to post that, that's too funny. <laughs> she thinks she's so cool. Oh, wait till everyone sees this. <laughs> oh, they will. I can't wait to see her face tomorrow. Hey, check this out. Hey, nice hat. Your mommy bought it for you? Actually, I bought it myself. Actually, I bought it myself. Wow, you talk dumber than you look. What's wrong with my hat? Other than the fact that you look like a loser? <laughs> So, what's the difference between bullying and just joking around? Bullying is when one person uses their power to hurt someone else on purpose. Maybe that power is their size or strength, or maybe it's their popularity. But all a bully really needs is the will to hurt somebody. So think about it. Do you know anyone who's experiencing physical, verbal, or cyber bullying? This survey is here to help. It's a way to get your voice heard. It's completely anonymous. No one will know but you. And it's not snitching if you're getting help from someone that really needs it. The only person who is going to make your school a safer place for everybody is you. Do you care? I care. I care. I care. I care. I care. We care. Help stop the bullying. That's it for your morning announcements. In the words of the great Tracy Saxon, Make it a great day or not, the, the choice, choice is, is yours. yours.